Hello everyone and welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. In the last episode, situation stream, whatever, uh, we made it to the downtown area. We are here and we are doing it. We didn't get a whole lot done. We mostly just did a lot of dialogue and talking to people. The prince dude, we talked to the freaking nines dude, we talked to his homies. And uh, basically we picked up a couple of missions. And uh, well, I say let's get started on doing some of that stuff. So I just kind of went over my missions off screen real quick just to kind of give myself a, an idea of what I need to do right now. But I am going to go up to this map real quick and double check where I want to go. So two things I want to check out. One is Skyline Apartments because one of the missions is sending me there. So that's number two and that's way the hell over there on the other side by Empire Arms. Okay. That's one thing I wanted to check out. And the other one I want to check out is Confession which is number five. That is where there's some... the girl... Um... There's a girl that I need to go find at confession, and I need to set her straight because her master's dead or whatever. I don't know, something like that. Anyway, and then the last place we need to go is obviously we need to go back to Venture Tower and uh, talk to the prince because we already talked to Nines, and now that we've done that, the prince is going to want to report on that. So maybe I'll go do that first since it's kind of on the way over here, and it's likely to just progress the main mission. So we might as well do that first, kind of kick the stream off with a little bit of main story situation. We also probably want to head back to the Santa Monica area soon, just to kind of wrap up missions we have there that I have lingering that I still kind of want to figure out if I get a chance. But anyway, we'll do that. Also, Denderferger, what's up, dude? Haven't talked to you in a minute. How you doing, man? What's up? Anyway, back to LaCroix. Let's get back to the elevator and get back to Mr. Prince motherfucker. Wait, can we not can we not just go up? Hello? Uh Um Wait, do I have to talk to the Do I really have to talk to Fat Boy? Hey Chunk, let me in boy. Yeah, you go right on up and see Mr. LaCroix. Ah, let's see what we got on good old yeah, see. Three. Oh well hello there. Oh boy. I've been thinking about you. Oh, yeah. Okay, maybe I had to talk to him. Also, he's over here creeping up on people on the freaking you nasty motherfucker. Wait, hold on. You're in Japan right now, Denderferger? That's fucking awesome, bro. Ten AM, huh? Well then you're you're gonna if you're not busy, you can hang out in the stream for a little while. But that's awesome, dude. How's how's Japan? What are you doing there? Just hanging out, vacation, like cool man anyway let's talk to the prince give the anarch community my regards i did i did done i will read you back the minutes <laughs> done blah blah woof woof done not a word done words of gold sage advice it made sense even amongst the noise um whatever just number one it nothing they haven't crassly delivered untold times within elysium you have to understand most of the anarchs know no better option or have been bullied into their cause by the unruly ones. You can't fault all for the boorishness of a few. Now that that's out of the way, I trust you're prepared to leave for the day. Um, yeah, totally. Uh, first I wish, um... Um, uh, yeah, first I... I suppose I can... Yeah, questions of face... Uh, you know what? I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to him anymore. I just wanted to report because that was part of the main mission. I didn't really need to ask him about anything. We learned enough from him last time. If I really need to talk to him about anybody later, I will. But for now, I just kind of want to move on with actually making progress. Sit here talking to that motherfucker for a billion years. Anyway, yes, you're on a train to Shizuoka. So you'll be around for about two hours in the stream. You're on vacation for the Rugby World Cup? Cool. I didn't know that was in Japan. Is that where it's at right now? Rugby World Cup's in Japan this year? I, I don't really watch rugby. I'm American. What can I say? We don't really play a lot of rugby around here. More of a niche sport in the U.S. Anyway, I'm heading over to probably the, I, I guess, I, I'm assuming it's a club. Also, is this girl's ass hanging out? Girl, you need to put on some clothes. What are you doing? Seriously, girl. It's cold out here. Says the girl with the short skirt and her thong hanging out, but still. Bitch gonna be cold. Also, confession, this is where I wanna go. Right? Confession. Oh, I thought confession was like a 
was like a, I guess, I don't know, why would it be called confession if it was like a church? That wouldn't make any sense. Alright, well I'm assuming I gotta go in here. Japan is doing really good, so people are going super crazy over there. Well, that's good. Usually when the home country is doing good in a World Cup or any, you know, world competition, it's pretty cool. Am I supposed to talk to somebody before I go in here? I guess not. We're in, dude. We're in the club. All right, we're in the city club. What's up, girl? <laughs> I knew you'd talk to me. I swear you were all, like, totally drawn to me. I'm surprised I don't know you. I usually meet all the L.A. vampires out on the scene. Not a lot of you out tonight, which is weird, because I don't know of any parties going on. Wow, this girl's voice is, like, purposefully annoying. I like it. Anyway, uh, any magnetism between us is purely your pre-perception playing pranks. <laughs> Let's go with that. No, come on. It's totally cool. I'm Patty. Seriously, everyone knows me. Besides, I just wanted to ask you if you've seen someone. Um, someone? Always? Everywhere. With names unknown. His name is Kent Allen Ryan. He's a Toreador. Really good looking. Dresses really well. Like all Prada, usually. Um, oh yes, Toreador. Groomed like a show cat. Yes, I have beheld him. Kent? No. Allen? No. Ryan? No. Kent Allen Ryan? Yes! Ahaha, <laughs> that joker. Oh, I don't know him. Those names have a melody, not fam and familiar. Um, let's just go with, um, yes, I have beheld him and see what she says. You are totally awesome. <laughs> it just goes to show you that you don't have to dress cute or care what you look like to be a cool girl. <laughs> so, where is Kent? <laughs> um, a puddle found him in the alley. He is outside cursing it. My eyes must have been blind and my mind stupid because I did not see him. I, I, you know what? Let's play her. Let's play along. Oh, that is totally Kent. He's so like that. I better go find him. He needs my help to do anything. Thanks again. Puddle outside is big enough to handle the scorn of two. All right, well, I, I think that that was the girl I was looking for. Yeah, the attention whore. That's who I was looking for. You have convinced Patty to go to some dark back alley. Now what? I don't know. I thought it would be funny. I don't really know what to do besides that that was just a good time anyway what's up girl um um it looks like you need a refill can i drink you let me get my coat i left it with a guy who'll be getting some off me tonight damn all right mm -hmm. <laughs> i checked out can i check you out too <laughs> this is going well oh see i'm telling good jokes she's laughing at my um. jokes Oh, baby, woo, baby, damn, baby, baby, aw, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like men a lot. That's funny times. All right, you know what? Let's move on. That's just one of those people you can just hit on. Uh, bartender, what's Everybody up? Everybody comes in here's got to have a shower. Damn, shot. she got that boob window, though. The first thing to go. Do more of these, and you'll be telling me your nastiest, dirtiest stories. I am your beat priestess, and it's time to confess. I'll tell you everything you want to hear. <laughs> Anyway, what name do I shout in a crowd to summon you? Yeah, what's your name, baby? Venus was her name. Got anything you want to confess? Um, um, if sin was mud, I would be a pig, but I may not share. Several moons have passed since the madness crept in. It was my own hands which launched buildings in Santa Monica. I'm gonna go with number two. Hmm, sounds serious. I'm going to need details, so I know whether to pour a Hail Mary or a Highway to Hell. Uh... Speak to my memory, I am gone. It was my own hands which long You know what, let's brag about that. We blew up that one building in Santa Monica. Oh yeah? I've been waiting for someone like you to come in here. You see, I've got this situation that's gotten a little out of hand and I need someone Ooh. to inform someone We might have unlocked a mission. Getting paid this month. Intrigued yet. Very. The ears salivate. Continue. Oh, I like that already. Well, the parking lot next to the Empire Hotel. Couple of guys, Russian accents, bit thick. I need you to tell them Venus doesn't have their money. That's it. Oh, yeah, that's gonna go well. Oh, yeah, she doesn't have your money. Bye. 
This specs this this task speaks to my will. Hmm, I expected you'd bite. Empire Hotel. Tell them I'm broke. You can run, right? Never mind. Just don't go starting <laughs> any street fights, alright? These guys are connected. Uh -oh. Anyhow, a lot of people have yet to confess to the beat priestess. Later, darling. So wait, I have to go there and run away? She doesn't want me to beat the shit out of him? Can't promise that. Anyway, I will be as the wind. Like words, I am wind. Also, while we're here, we might as well. You know what I mean? Might throw down a little bit of that action. You know. Gotta be part of the party. If we're here, we might as well. You know what I mean? This place doesn't really have a like a stage though it's just dj music all right i've had enough of your wily dances get out of the way bitches anybody else in here to talk to or pass to check out i do see another dude over there with the mask but he just might be a bouncer what about this lady you are you important mm -hmm. nope just got her boobs hanging out that's all you're not important you're not important all right well we've run our course here i guess can we go in this door that door locked. All right. Well, wait. There's a bathroom. Wait, we. I didn't try to open this door, but I assumed it's not openable. All right. Well, confession wasn't too uh, terribly interesting, but in terms of it up a place, but at least we could dance for a minute and progress a mission. So this girl I sent outside into the alley. Do I have? Wasn't the whole idea is I have to get rid of her? Isn't that what the dude asked me to do? Let's see if she's back here. Wait, where's she at? Is this not the dark alley she went to? Oh, she is that that's her right there. No? That's not her. Wait, what dark alley did she go to? This one? Ah, there wait. Hold on. Hello. I beg your pardon. This This isn't her either, right? Wait, maybe back here? No. Huh. Seriously, what dark alley did she go to? I'm confused. Okay, so attention, when you've convinced Patty to go down some dark back alley, like that's all it says, it's just some dark back alley. Okay. No, I beg your pardon. But I beg your pardon. Which dark back alley was it? I don't even know. Like, what dark back alleys are there? I have no idea. Anyway, whatever. Um, I'm not gonna worry about it unless it's like over down, like by uh, number eleven, which is what is number eleven? It's not even on this list. Maybe she's in the one right in front of me, right here. Oh, maybe. Well, that's a nope. That's a hot nope. Yeah, I don't know where the fuck she went unless she went down that way. I guess I could go check. Wait, is that her? Maybe that's her. Hold on, that might be her right there. Hello. What are you doing here? Where's Kent? Just came to say hi. Why are you looking at me like that? Am I looking at you some way? I don't know. Uh, there's way too many people around here, man. I wonder if it'll let me assassinate her. I kind of want to just eat, suck her blood if I can. That's mostly what I want to do. But there's too many people around, man. All right, hold up. While she just stands there, I'm just going to wait. I'm just going to give it a moment. I'm going to let this homeless guy <laughs> wander on by. Don't be coughing on me, bro. I don't want your... I want your AIDS. Get out of here with your AIDS. All right, ready? Ready? And feed! Ooh, should I leave her alive, though? Eh, fuck it. The mission called for her death. The mission... Aw, oh, man. What happened? That, 
That guy didn't. Aw, oh, son of a bitch. The cops are after me, bro. Son of a bitch. How did somebody catch me, man? I was all good, and then all of a sudden I wasn't. That was lame. Well, I'll just wait for the heat to die down, I guess. There was more to that quest, but GG. What was my other option? Like, she wouldn't. She didn't want to talk to me. That's what she gets. She should have talked to me. Anyway, I solved the patty problem. I did it. <laughs> I just did it the fucking fuck you way. That's okay. That wasn't the main mission right now, anyways. So I needed to go to the Empire Arms Hotel, and the other one was to go to the Skyline Apartments. <sighs> well, are the police after me or not? I can't really tell at the moment. Like, it didn't say, did it? Oh, yeah, you know what I haven't done in a while? Fucking this. Jesus, 32 experience points? Where have I been? Alright, hold on. We got some things to do. Um, wanna, 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 wanna. What do I even wanna do? Uh. Wait, didn't I learn security before? Did I not save it? Dude. I totally put some money or points into security before. Son of a bitch. I bet you. Hmm. I don't know when, when, when did I, how, mm, I don't know how I didn't save that, but, you know, I'll throw one more level into that just because. I swear I saved that, though. I think I, you lo I lost my points in the Haunted Mansion when I died, but I thought I did those level ups back when I was in the freaking hospital. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember now. It's been too long. It's been too long. That ship has sailed. It's fine. That was like the last level up I did anyways, obviously. Um, I kind of want to be more schmexy, so we're going to go ahead and throw my, some more in my appearance. <laughs> uh, I'm also going to go ahead and do one more charisma. And then... Hmm, I wouldn't mind another strength. What's intelligence for? Actually, this might be good too. I'm just kind of trying to use up like little bits of four, but I think I'm I've run my course of fours. Oh well, yeah, because these cost five. These ones cost three only. Yeah. Well, is there any of these that I want to turn on right now, or turn on learn right now that are only three? Measures of characters willing to steal fear. Yeah, I don't care about that. Or seal their motives. Oh, you know what? These might be worth it because I think these are. Yeah, let's do that. Take a little less damage, maybe. Alright, that's good. Now, I don't know if the police are still after me or not. Honestly, I could really give a shit if they are. I didn't see it. Huh. Wait. I just don't know if that that means the police are after me or not. Uh... Man, that guy's still running around. Find out. Oh, he's after me. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Ah, shit, dude. They're shooting me in the ass. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Alright. I guess we'll just hang out over here. get the cops to just stop man. gotta hide like it's goddamn GTA like seriously stop chasing me motherfuckers until the music stops I know we ain't done <sighs> music stop all right well here we go police hunting that's what I was waiting for all right wait till it says police gives up and then we'll move on I wish I, I wish I could go in my menu and let this kind of pass while I look at some stuff, but I think I just have to sit here and wait, unfortunately. 
Okay, so anyway, I want to go to the Skyline Apartments next, I think. Which I'm pretty sure are just down the street over here. There is a policeman right over there at the end of the street, but he don't see me. Yay, they gave up. Alright. Now we're looking good. Dude. Oh my god. Can I get out of here? Jesus. Okay. We're safe. Forever. Tra la la. Skyline Apartments. There they is. Let's get in there. We in. Now, we're here looking for Paul or somebody. Somebody like that. Employees only my ass. Let's walk on in. Uh, you know what? I will check down here first. You never know what you might find if you go downstairs first. Ooh, like a computer! Alright, you have one email, one unread. Well, let's check out that email. Oops. Password required. Hack that shit. Wait, uh... Oh, my skill's too low? Shit. Wait. What did it say? It said open, or, oh, oh, now, okay. I'm not actually making progress there. Okay, so I don't know the password, I don't, I'm not good enough to hack it, unfortunately, which means I probably can't look at this either. Oh, maybe I can. Apartment 1. Simon Milligan, he's on TV, so odds are... Footage of his place will be worth something eventually. I gotta keep an eye on him. Okay, so apartment one is Simon. That's not who we're looking for. Apartment two. Sean Milton. He's a slob and he never really has chicks over. Some guy has been staying with him lately, so I haven't wanted to watch much. Okay. Apartment three. Georgia Welch. This rich broad is pretty hot. Oh, the password on her door is 9648. So maybe I'll sneak in there and steal some panties to auction off online. Hey, Dendifer, this is what you could do with those dirty panties you get for, in Japan. You could sell them online. Auction them. <laughs> anyway, 9648, try to remember that. Uh, apartment 4, here we go. Uh, vacant, no reason to keep an eye on this one. Okay, apartment 5. Paul Anderson, that's who we're looking for. I thought there was no reason to watch him, but then I caught him upstairs. I'll keep the tape rolling. Okay, so apartment 5, check that out. Hannah Glazer, the gold mine. Something hot is always going down in here, and that's something usually Hannah herself. Oh, yeah. So, apartment, um, uh, what was it? Three? Yeah, 9648. Okay, just remember that. That's all I care about. Uh, no, quit. Sorry. Forgot the buttons. Can you look at this one, too? Oh, shit. Yo, you can actually, like, monitor all the freaking rooms. You dirty freak! You sick freak! The one running this place, man, he's a sick freak. Or maybe he's just a freak. I guess sick and freak can go hand in hand. Oh, there's a freaking way to go into the sewers from here? Okay, noted, I guess. Oh, I know the dirty I know the dirty underwear, dirty panties, vending machines are a real thing. I wasn't I mean it was a joke, yes, but not a joke in the sense that I'm mocking that that even exists. I know that exists. But it got brought up earlier in the chat, so I figured I'd chime in on that since we're talking about dirty panties in the video game. All right, anyway, up we go. All right, well I guess we'll just start with Floor one? Does it matter? Is it like condos where each floor... Oh, yeah, it is. Each floor is its own apartment. Okay. Interesting. Well, I wanted to go to apartment three and, a, and five. And maybe even four because it's vacant. Um, yeah. Let's check out three first, though. 9648. Dirty panties on the way. 
Wow, it takes a long time to go two fucking floors, doesn't it? All right. Nine. Do I have to just... Boom. No? Maybe? Yeah. Is she home, though? The problem is, is this lady home? Because I just walked into her house. Hello? Hello? I mostly just wanted to come in here because, you know, you want to explore everywhere you can go. Okay, well, she doesn't seem to be in this room. Closet! Ooh, it's a sneaky hole. Why is there a vent in the back of a fucking... Really? Also, yo. Alright, well, we need a code to open up that. She's got a panty vault, guys. She's got an entire vault dedicated to panties. Also, this mirror doesn't work. I'm, I must be a vampire or something because I can't see myself in the mirror. JK. I mean, not JK about the vampire thing. I obviously am a vampire. Oh, the safe. Let's check that out. Oh, I need a password for the safe, do I? Hack it. Ah, damn it. I'm not going to know this one, am I? Nope. Oh, well. Also, you forget what the game is called, but you played a game where they timed out how long it takes to go up one floor on a freight elevator and then put that timing into the game. Well, then. That sounds like a riveting video game. Found the pantry. Not the panty, but the pantry. Also, a downstairs bathroom. Wow, these are nice. Wow, it's a condo that has an upstairs and a downstairs. Nice, dude. Fucking nice. Like in an apartment building. Crazy. Okay, well, anyway. um, I don't know. Is there any reason to go in these vents, like, at all? Does this just lead into the bedroom? Alright, well. I don't know what the code to the fucking... computer is to help me figure out the code for the safe, unfortunately. But I guess we'll get the fuck out of here for now. Until we... either get better at hacking, or... I don't know. Maybe there'll be a quest that'll lead me here and I'll need to get something out of her apartment. Maybe that's the whole point. I don't have to sneak in and like learn the code from her or something. Anyway, we're going to apartment five. That's our main goal, so let's do that. Came here to talk to Paul. It was more of like an Edith Finch type game where you're just mostly like interactive storybook. Oh, okay. Well then having like real time stuff like the elevator kind of just adds to it then I guess. Anyway, Paul. Come to say hello. This place is not creepy with its round red rug and couch that blends in. Oh shit, Paul dead as fuck. Yo, Paul, you okay there, buddy? He's not looking too good. Not good at all, in fact. Hi, Paul. It's Hannah. Just calling to see how you are. I hope I didn't give you what I've got. Ugh, I feel like crap. Actually, I need to ask you a favor. Could you pick me up some cold medicine at the store? <laughs> I hate to bother you, but... I can't seem to get out of bed. The code on my door is 1203. Hey, listen, I, uh, had a really good time the other night. Maybe we could do it again sometime. Sorry, I'm rambling. Okay, bye. I don't think you'll be doing anything again with this guy. Ever. Anyway, 1203, right? She said 1203? I think that was what she said. Alright, well. I guess we shall explore his room. And apparently his his washer dryer one of them is running that's cool all right well, anyway another raid i don't know who the fuck killed this guy unless he got sick based you know he's she said i hope you didn't get what i got i'm assuming that means she's sick i guess if we go up to her apartment maybe she's dead too we're gonna go find out in a second with the 1203 anyway dead book dead book what i don't know what that even meant 
What I meant to say is TV is off. <laughs> I like his zebra walls. What the hell? Shitty paint jobs. Wow, really? There's just nothing in these houses, man. All right. All right, well, the mystery of the apartment building, we are unfolding it, I guess. 1203, let's go do it. There doesn't seem to be anything else up in this bitch, so... 1203. She was the bitch that lived on the top floor, I believe. That was the one where the landlord was like, that's where all the action is. Hand is the one going down, or whatever he said. That is one happening pad. Certainly is. Alright. Anyway. 1203, baby. We in. Hannah, is you alive? I didn't bring you any cold medicine, but the real question is, is you alive? Oh, oh shit. Uh, did I fuck up? Uh, I knocked the key off the table, man. Shit. I didn't even know I could do that. Shit. Shit. Can I still get it? Ah, shit. Have I seen any Big Jaw? What the hell is Big Jaw, Dragon? I have no idea. Right on, now I see some Big Fail. Because I'm an idiot. I mean, I didn't even know I could do that. Fucking lame, dude. <sighs> Why would they put a vase that I could grab in the way? Like, I was trying to move it out of the way so I could grab the damn key. Fucking game. Alright, yeah, you can give me a link to it later. Is this a person? Like a... Like a... Like a YouTuber or a Twitch person or something? Big Jaw. He's a comedian. Big Jaw, he's a comedian. Hmm. Even then, that still doesn't sound familiar. Anyway, she dead as fuck, isn't she? Oh, wait, no, she alive. Yo, you right there? Paul, is that... Hey, you're not Paul. Who are you? What are you doing in here? <coughs> I'm just checking on you. Paul was blinded by the light. What? <coughs> Call the police. Uh, let the veils of madness paint you a vision of Paul. Donut lovers, decease! Or disease, I need the answers in your fevered mind, little fly. I'm picking the first one to scare the shit out of her. Or to freak the fuck out of her, whatever. Oh, we're just pretending we're Paul, that works. Okay. Yes, sweet little fly, tell me of the sickened spider who bit you. Oh, Paul. You say the most beautiful things. <laughs> you want to know how I got sick? <coughs> how sweet of you to ask. So sweet. Tell me your tale, little fly. <coughs> Her name was Jezebel. Jezebel Locke. I'm usually not too good with names, you know, but hers was so strange. <coughs> I can't seem to get it out of my head. Okay. Uh, did you dance with the spider, little fly? Yeah. I mean, I think so. To tell you the truth, I don't really remember a whole lot about that night, you know. <coughs> Everything's a little blurry, you know. I mean, I'm not usually, you know, into women. But I remember feeling so attracted to her. I thought she was the most beautiful woman I'd ever seen. <coughs> really? Well, the next thing that's clear <coughs> is when I woke up the next morning. <coughs> I haven't been feeling too well since then. To tell you the truth, I have other friends who, who've uh, worked with her, and they're not doing so hot either, you know? <coughs> Where was this black widow? She had a room at the Empire Hotel. I can't remember the number. <coughs> Paul, I really like you. You were so nice to me the other night. I don't, I don't meet a lot of guys like you. Paul is six feet closer to hell, little fly. <laughs> no one will miss your tattered soul. Farewell. Uh -huh. Wow. Did she really just die? I didn't do it. Wasn't me, dude. Oh, come on. What do you mean? I have, like, level 3 like lockpick skill, don't I? What the ass? Like, seriously, how fucking high a lockpick skill do they expect me to have fucking unlock shit? 
Am I really gonna have to do a blood buff to get this shit open? Probably. Lame sauce. Yo, got that money though. Let's go. I'll take it. She ain't gonna need it. <laughs> I mean, not to be insensitive or anything, that bitch dead as fuck. Also, she got an appointment book. I don't know what the point of that is, but let's find out. Appointment book. This looks like a standard appointment book. 954. Arthur Kilpatrick. Meet Arthur at his place in Santa Monica. Remember to bring the handcuffs and the orange jumpsuit as he likes to play lockdown at the women's prison. This guy is sick. We happen to know Arthur, don't we? Anyway, Vandal C. 7.30 at the blood bank. Blood bank. Bring pliers and a blowtorch. What the hell? Okay. David Hatter. Room 413 at the Lucky Star in Hollywood. He likes that weird umbrella and water balloon thing. The fuck? Anyway, Simon Milligan downstairs in his room. God, I hate that guy. Well, I'll go hate on him if you want. Anyway, 917. Jezebel Locke. New client. Responded my ad in the paper. She has a suite at the Empire Hotel. I don't know what to think of this one, but there's something about her, her voice. I don't know. She's offering big bucks, so I guess I can't pass it up. And last but not least, we got Paul Anderson, an honest-to-God date. I can't believe he asked me out. I'm so excited. And now you're both dead. Not so excited about it anymore. Well, oh, and her body just disappeared? Okay. Well, then. <sighs> well, I kind of wish I could get that key back there. I might have to, like, leave the, leave the building to get it to reload, maybe. I'm going to try that. I'm gonna hope that that works. Cause I'm gonna be upset if I can't get that key. I'm gonna be a sad panda man. A sad panda man. Or panda woman. It won't let you jump in the elevator, it's unsafe. We'll go outside, let the zone load, and then we'll go back in. You could probably use the TCL command to no clip through the dresser to get the key if it doesn't work. How do you do that? Is there a menu for putting in commands like that? But see, last time I opened up the console window, the game froze. I want to try to avoid that. Anyway, let's just hope the key just respawns where it's supposed to be. I'm hoping. expect you to do like seriously I mean it's probably not required anyway it's just a side quest thing but it's still dumb so I guess I'm gonna try this no clip thing let me just save it um save real quick If I go to the console and I type TCL, just TCL. How do I? How do? How does it? Uh, what's the syntax for it, man? No clip. There you go. No clip on. Let's just do that. See, so yeah, when I open up the console window, it freezes.
Yeah, so like, if you go into the, if you do this menu, it just freezes. And it's like it, like it just won't let me, like the buttons just stop working. Unless there's like, oh, oh, holy shit. What have you done? I can't see. <laughs> I clipped through the fucking floor. Whoa, dude. What the hell? All right, now I'm lost. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let me uh, let me reload that. All right. I figured it out. I figured out how to get I just it just like automatically launched me through the floor. I wasn't ready for that, man. Okay, hold on. Let me let me try that again and see if we can get this shit. I just want this freaking key, man. That's all I want. Let me get that key, though. Come on, just let me get it. Dude, if you move a little bit, it just makes you go flying. I'm trying to just go like a little bit. Let me get this fucking key. There we go. Ugh. Got it. Okay. Hiya, dude. All right. Now, can we turn this shit back off? No clip. Holy moly. Whew. Okay. I think I fixed it. Oh, Jesus. Oh jeez, can we save that shit? Cause I don't want to do that again. That was, that was rough. You like move it a little tiny bit, and that shit freaking just dot. Like it just fucking makes you go flying. Like I barely pressed W that first time I turned off no clip, and it fucking tossed me. Also, what the fuck key did I just get? I wasn't even paying attention. I was too busy with that bullshit. Um. No seriously, what the fuck key did I just get? Key ring. I got this, uh, the safe key, is that what I got? Okay, I got the safe key. Uh, she didn't have a safe, right? Did she? Oh wait, yeah she did. And I already, I already broke into her damn safe. I don't even need it. Fucking A. Well then. Worth it. Okay, uh, what was my other thing that I wanted to do? Uh, I wanted to go, I kind of wanted to go back to floor th three, I think it was. The room that has the, the room that, the other room that had the, the key, the key lock thing that I wanted to learn, or the open. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to blood buff again, and I'm going to see if I can, it'll up my ability to hack. I don't know if it'll up my hacking ability, but we're going to try it. I'm gonna give it a shot. The password for this bitch's computer is probably around this motherfucker somewhere. But what are you gonna do? You anyway, know, let me just try it one more time. Safe. Control C. Nah. Okay. Let's just do. Uh, let me quit out of here real quick. Blood buff it. Now try. not gonna work ah <sighs> blood buff doesn't work on that i guess it only works for st other stats lame okay whatever i had to try because i wanted to get in there damn it whatever we have a heading let's get out of here i should even check my my thing solve the patty problem Hannah has pointed you in the direction of Jezebel Locke as a possible link to the Plague Bearer chain. She makes her residence at the Empire Arms Hotel. Which is funny, because I need to go to the parking lot next to that place and talk to the Russians there as well. So we'll do that while we're at it. I'll probably do the hotel thing first, because the Russians probably not going to be a friendly bunch. Just saying. Well, maybe. 
Maybe if I negotiate with them and intimidate them, I won't have to fight them. But I'd rather do that after I uh, investigate this whole Jezebel bitch. Alright, so the Empire Hotel is literally right here. Let's do it. In fact, the parking lot was probably where I ran back over there away from the cops. I guess it has to be. There's not really any other area for that to be a parking lot. Alright, well, who are we looking for? Jezebel? You have to know where Jezebel's at, bro? Yes? May I help you? Yeah. I seek Queen Jezebel, bitch. Yes. Miss Locke is one of our more, um, popular guests. Why do you ask? I need the key to her kingdom, motherfucker. I can't do that. It's against hotel policy. I am the key master, and you will make me a key. I see. Well, in that case, perhaps I can make an exception. Damn right Here's you can. Here's the key to her suite. Have a nice evening. You fucking damn right you can, bitch. Anyway, thanks. That lock shall now open up to me. Alright. Uh, it didn't really tell me which suite she's in, but who gives a fuck? There's a Jezebel button, right? Yeah, I have no idea which room she's in. Maybe the key will say. Uh, key ring. It doesn't really say. Uh, okay. Well. Does it, this say? No. Well, whatever. Pick a floor. We're going to floor five because whatever. Oh, wow. Full loading, too. No elevator ride to floor five. All right. Ballroom. I don't think this is where I need to be, man. Room number four? Or maybe it is. Maybe it is. Apparently I picked the exact right floor because I'm a fucking genius. Oh, yeah. Who do we have here? Hello. Are you a believer, little morsel? Have you come for the kind of enlightenment only Jezebel can give? Um, are you the wicked queen? Queen? Ah, yes. I am Jezebel. Jezebel Locke. You are Malkavian, are you not? Speaking in twisted riddles, your eyes dancing with visions they don't understand. Won't you dance with Jezebel, little morsel? Uh, I'd rather pierce my tongue with barbed wire. Oh, come on now. Don't deny yourself the pleasure of Jezebel's talents. Just a few more steps and we can be enveloped by the sweet darkness, become slaves to the desires of our wasted flesh. Yeah, there's a strange seduction in your viral reproduction. Oh, you cannot escape me, little morsel. One way or another, you and I will intertwine our beings on the way into the night circle, and I will send you forth. Full of the sweet sickness I carry. Pass. <laughs> Sounds cool. Is this some kind of club? Where can I join? Don't you stick to the paid seductresses. Dark is my soul, but dark are your dreams in hell. Die. No. Let's go with uh, that one. Who better Second than one. prostitutes to carry the dark gift I bring? Oh, will they not share it with the rest of those who revel in the pleasures of the flesh? Trust I will revel with your headless corpse, Dark Queen! Oh shit. What? What happened? Uh. The screen's all shaky. Oh, she. Oh, she won a fight. It, like, threw me back outside the door, though. Um. I wonder if I should bring a weapon. Uh. You know what? Severed hands never steered me wrong. Let's do it. Kia! Ow! Oh my god, did you see that damage though? Okay, I did zero. I did zero point zero. She chasing me? Oh fuck. Alright, well that's not good. Alright, well I'm gonna die. Oh, all oh, the fists! The fists of fury for the win, dude! Oh motherfucker but hey that works let's do that again the fists are much better i didn't realize the fucking severed hand would do zeros like zero point zero 
But it looks like I could beat the shit out of it with my fists. Oh, I'm back here. It did say Skyline Apartments. Oh, wait, I didn't even have an auto save. That was my fucking main save that I made. That's all right. All I did was literally go get the key and then I went to a room, so it's okay. I have two points in brawling, so my fists are a lot better. I guess that's true. There is like a stat for when you're actually using weapons, isn't there? Either way, I think I'll make a save when I get up there this time before I throw down with her. Just because it seems like it's not going to be that easy. That bitch sliced me, I think, like only four times and I died. I gotta get the upper fist on her face. The upper fist on your face, bitch. The melee status for when you have weapons? Okay, yeah. My brawling is better than my melee, I'm pretty sure. Alright. Back to the hotel. Motel. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Bro, I need that key again. Yes? May I help you? Yeah. Yes. Key to I key. Can. I am the I key see. master, motherfucker. Bye. Bye. Back up, purple haired motherfucker. I'm busy. I still don't know how the hell I picked the correct floor for this place, but maybe I just can't go to every floor like I thought maybe you could. Anyway, let's save it again. Since apparently there's no autosave here. There is an autosave. For some reason it didn't autosave when I died. Whatever. Anyway, what's up, B is Natch? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Queen. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, come on. Oh. Oh, yeah. Who bet? Bitch! Get it! Oh, she got the knife skill. Bat, bat, bat! Oh, oh, oh! Bat! Ah, bat, 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 bat! Bat, bat! Uh, get it! Woo! I should have done that sooner. Oh, damn, that kick across the room, though! Get it! Get it! Oh, she was one hit away from death! Ah, oh, come on! Ah! Oh. All right, all right, I see how it is. I see how it is, game. I'll go blood buff immediately. I, 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 I was just trying to avoid using all, of, all my blood up, but you know what? Whatever, dude, we're using it. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, come. Oh, yes. I follow the path. Uh, I do not wish the gels in the truth. So you will, you will die. Hey. Oops, fuck. I wasn't ready. Nope. Dude, swing, bitch. There you go. Fucking roundhouse kick that bitch across the room. Nope. There it is. Get it. Come on. She's like one hit. There it is. There it is. Come on. One more. Come on. Yeah. We got that, bitch. Let's go. Also, I don't want your stinking knife. Go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. Get it. Alright, well done. Fuck that bitch up. Now give me your ABC. Always be closing. What does that even mean? Oh, I bet you it's a skill book. Oh, I don't have enough research. I've killed Jezebel before I to lamb. So, Alright, cool. That was what we came to do for that mission. That mission is done. Good stuff. Alright, question about this situation. I need... Uh, wait, which stat was it? <laughs> I forgot what it was already. Uh, wait, I need a research stat. Where the hell is that stat at? Uh, I guess research is over on the right. The intelligence attribute and the scholarship ability. Okay, that's what I need. Intelligence and scholarship. Got it. So scholarship is only three. Intelligence is going to cost me six. So... I'm down to learn this one. 
I got my research up to four. I still need more to learn than what's in that book, though. I need, I need six, right? Yeah. Do I have any other books like that? I think there was one book back at the pawn shop in the other, in Santa Monica area. But that required, like, a level up in my research as well. That's alright, though. At least now I understand how... That basically just taught me how to look at how, or how your stats level up a little better as well. So that's helpful. Yeah, if anything that forces me to start learning a little bit more about small mechanics like that is good. Alright. Anyway. What I do know is my fists are mightier than my severed hand. Mentally noted. Alright, well, fuck. Murder that bitch. We out. Cool. Well done. Let's go fucks with some Russians, shall we? Alright. Also, I kind of feel a sneeze coming on right now. Hopefully it doesn't come to anything. Don't you dare sneeze. Don't you dare. Alright, Russians. Where are you, you rad Russians? I've come to say hello to your faces. You look like the rad Russians. Hello. Confession, bitch, send you. <laughs> Confession, bitch. I hail from Venus. Money. Where is money? Her purse is empty. No salmon tonight for you, Grizzly. No money? Oh, I could do some a little... I could... Mm, I could do a little bit of a... Manipulation here. Let's try that. You salmon. You must eat salmon. Hey. Hey. I actually didn't mean to kill the guy. Crap. Whatever. I might as well murder these fuckers. That wasn't exactly how I intended for that to go down. But hey, they're down. Run away. <laughs> I'm really good at this video game, if you couldn't tell. Jesus Christ. Move the fuck out of the way. Wait, what? Hello? Are you blocking my way right now? Jesus Christ. That motherfucker would not get the hell out of my way. I guess I'll just hide back here until the freaking thing dies down. That bitch was all up in my way, though. I was about to punch a bitch, for real. I didn't want to because I was in, I didn't want to, like, draw attention to the fucking cops. But I was about to punch that hoe right in the dumb face. Get the hell out of my way, NPC. You are not important. I'm a very murderous vampire. Has anybody notice that? I murdered that one bitch without even trying to, con you know, progress that one mission. I just beat the shit out of those Russians, kind of, just because. I should just let them shoot at each other. That's what they were doing. I'm stupid. I just started swinging like an idiot. I don't know what the hell I was doing. I thought he was shooting at me at first, and he, or like he was just not shooting accurately, but he was actually shooting his homies. That was my problem. I should have let them shoot each other. Whatever, dude. Anyway, let's go tell her the good deed we did for her, because we're just that good. It's been dealt with. What? What? Your message was delivered, goddess. I can't hear you. Let's talk in my office. Oh, shit. Done. Fucking mayhem, bro. Yeah, dude. It's fucking mayhem. 